Jesus, it's hot in here. I've got a fan and everything going, but it's just uh, not calming down. Right, I've done that. I've uh, removed various things. Um, I even reset the internet just to make certain. Anyway, I sailed this way because one, we need to get back to Crescent Isle because that's what we're meant to be making our base. And two, I'm meant to be going here to uh, uh, try and get that bloody uh, special thing called a special charm or whatever it's called. Jesus, look at that! Wow. Where we got our ass handed to is just uh, completely destroyed now. Pretty much. I'm just gonna save it for a minute because it's still saying I've got. This is gonna be people watching, but you know what? That's fine. Because I need to do a bit of grinding. So, yeah. I think this guy... Mm. Oh, he needs something, we can't remember what it was. I have to get him his stuff. Yep, this town is fun. So the zone forces to collapse so easily before the balloon attack. Alas, no one ever dreamed the balloons would come through the north down all straight. What with the sky with blocking the way? I got a really off guy and sign cans of the place. Yeah, I bet he was mad, especially when he didn't fucking listen to us when we said, uh, by the way, you're uh, gonna be attacked. Just laughing his ass off, going, no! <laughs> No, we're not. No one's gonna attack us. But, oh, he's not in here. Shit. So just run the and go. Oh, that bloody guy's not here. Damn it. The merchant that's meant to be here. The merchant that's meant to be bloody here is uh, gone. Well, fuck. Soldiers have been captured and taken away. The rest have been disarmed and all weapons of town have been seized. Well, as much as I spared? Well, as it, as it is said, with enough gold, you can buy your way out of Lewin Grand Fortress. <laughs> Good point. So instead of arresting this guy and, uh, you know, taking away all of his weapons because you don't want the, you don't want people arming themselves, the uh, the invading forces were like, uh, you know what? You give us money, and we won't give a shit about it. Oh, I hope there is a chance to get that thing again, because. Uh, I sold them earlier, okay. Yeah, I found out that those treasures you are just meant to sell, they have no uh, no other redeeming quality. Which is good, it means I've get, got some extra money back. But I mean, shit, that man. Bloody man's gone. I need to find him because he's got a reward for me. Like, for helping me, he'll actually give me uh, something. Oh, this 
weird freaking merchant again. Right, do you actually have anything slaying? Hmm. That's interesting. Uh, its background is unknown. But it gives you bonuses to defense, hit, will, and quick. Hmm. Oh, we've already got a slayer, hang on. Fair enough. This place just bombed to shit. <coughs> and that's uh, cut off, so I'm guessing I don't need to go that way. Taking so much, but this war is still flowing. Mm. That's a bloody mercy, considering uh, certain war torn countries get so. Uh, just so fucked, you know? Oh no, what happened? Did they take your money? <laughs> my shop, my shop is gone, it's too much spare. My shop is nothing more than a human rubble, and my clerk ran off with all the money, of course he did. What about Cypher, you know? Well, it's maybe you should take her with us on our ship. Ship? You want a ship? How big is it? How much cargo can it hold? How much money do you make transporting goods? <laughs> you may not look like that much, but you seem to be doing well for yourself. Okay, I have to decide. I'll go with you on your ship or something. Hold on a second, you can't just decide over yourself. As a trader, I can help you find treasures that would normally be almost impossible to find. As a merchant? Oh, okay then. Don't know why I need a merchant, but okay then. Done all my values, cooks here, the company, you know, fall down with the anyway. That money and place to play, the only thing left is to sit here and whisper sweet things to each other by the fountain. Yeah, I thought that was. There we go, a champ. That's not what I was after, but I'll have to fucking settle for it. There you go, you little bastard. I was mainly trying to find those Arcanian charms. I'm hoping I haven't screwed myself over by uh, not seeing that guy again. Hmm. I wonder, is there. Uh... Oh yeah, I think this guy is, uh, yeah, ships. Why oh, is the Valiant? <laughs> Wish somebody called me Valiant. Valiant. Right, what, uh, what do you have? Ooh. Enhanced kitchen, state of the art. Cooking facilities for great tasting dinners every night. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Compound deck and print figure. Hmm. Huh. Whoa, what's that? A ten inch secondary cannon with a reinforced barrel that helps absorb shock. Hmm. A Valuan torpedo. New rotating main cannon developed for Valuan destroyers, available on the black market. Right, okay. If I buy just one of them, I could have two of them and a torpedo. 
to try and be smart, you know? Right, there you go. And we have two of these. And then a single torpedo. Well, I mean, it's a single torpedo bay, rather. Magic, defense, and... Enhanced kitchen. Why would I need a... You know what, I probably need an enhanced kitchen because there's probably going to be someone that I'm going to pick up and he's going to be all like, Oh, I'm not going to ride with you unless you have a kitchen. You better have a decent fucking kitchen. There we go. Yep, up here is this chap. This should be to catch coin. How did you find it? I'll pay you 20,000 gold for it. That sounds good. You said to me, that's wonderful. We've been searching for this coin for ages. No idea if I need it for something else, but... There you go. Guys, doing in business? Probably not. Then the Sultan and his family were all executed. Ooh. They say they were all dragged off to Valua and they were executed in front of a huge crowd. Yeah, that sounds about right. I can't believe it. how could the Sultan be reduced to this? You used to come here, have either died or left town, there's almost no one left. Perhaps there's nothing left to do but close up shop. Hey, come with us! Come with us, we need the bartender! Never mind, he's useless. And from the looks of it, I don't think you can... No, you can't go that way anymore. Okay. Oh, where the hell did that guy disappear to? Uh. Yeah, I'm probably fucked. I'm never gonna get that uh, special champ thing then. Just a shame because if you get enough of them, you can get you can like superpower Cupil, and Cupil becomes like the most powerful weapon in the game. Which I think is kind of funny. Attack for and get revenge, even if he has to do it all by himself. Wait a minute, I can see nipples on these guys. Whew. Well, that's the stream uh, take it down. Too many nips. Are you sure you want to do this, man? It seems a bit stupid. Ow! Ah, crap! Damn it all! They called me the best gun around. I was Kazim, the crack shot. But I never got down before I could do anything that stopped them. The enemy turned the whole city to dust. It really chaps my hide. I think I'll fly right over to Valor and give them a blast of the chops. Or you could join us. No, 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 you do anything like that and you'll get blasted right back. It's way too reckless. So says the man who so recklessly escaped from Lua twice. Yeah, but that's impressive now. What 
I said. You are not. Ha ha! Could you be that pirate vice who, abdu who abducted the Luan Prince and blasted your way out of the Grand Fortress? Well, I don't know about the abduction part, but otherwise, yes, I am indeed vice. In that case, you gotta do this for me, nice. Let me join your crew. That sounds about right. I'll never be satisfied until I have delivered a blow for my cannon to blue her. Mission forces with you become your ship's gunner. Good, it is decided. Doesn't sound like you'll take no for an answer, so I suppose we might as well come aboard. Oh well, yeah, we need a big crew. Let's see, I've got... Let's see what I've got. I've got, um, that boy is a, uh, sailor, so I assume I need quite a few different sailors. To do all the, uh, you know, uh, menial work that helps the ship keep running. We've got, um, someone to watch out the mast, someone to, uh... Um, yeah, we've got someone else to wash out the mass. We've got somebody else to, uh... Hmm? Oh! There's a the little fucker! Woo! Right, that's another moonfish on the, on the recipe. I did wonder where the other moonfish were. I've bought some new things to reinforce the hull and stuff. I wonder if that was what the prince was on about by reinforcing the hull. Oh, there you are. Right. If it was, then uh, yeah, I've just reinforced the hull. Oh wait, don't I have, um, yeah, I just realised, don't I have those, uh, oh, no, wrong bit, Captain Stripes, there we go, now my ship's just that little bit more powerful, haha, <laughs> I assume this is the final ship we get in the game anyway, right, Let's get to the back to Crescent Isle! Oh, it's over here somewhere, wasn't it? There, it's right ahead, dead ahead. Fair enough, right behind the. Uh, Valua. Which I think is kind of funny. Oh shit, these ones are not going to take, uh, these ones are not going to surrender, not going to surrender that easy. Yeah. yeah. Ah. Ooh, ouch. Where's that picture gone? Over there. <laughs> Gun down! There we go. God damn it, Enrique. I was expecting him to be more of a powerhouse, but... Ouch. Right, what colour are these fuckers? Purple. That's why I'm doing less damage than usual.
There we go, that's better. Ha! Fuck you! Woohoo! Oh, damn it, Enrique, you are shit. Wow, weaker than Phoenix attack. Which is pretty bad. That wasn't so bad. Well, Prince hasn't said anything about the upgrades having uh, improved the ship in any way, so I'm guessing we have to first make base here. And then we can probably get the upgrades to go through the... Uh, uh, different channel walls and such. Oh, this is pretty amazing, huh? Oh god, look at Enrique, it looks like he's about to vomit. Hey, Enrique, how does it feel when you get outside of Imperial Palace? Uh, uh. Everything is so... Uh, so beautiful. I've never seen anything like it. This looks almost a little airsick. Perhaps all this travelling is a little rough on our sheltered prince. Yes, I can correct. I, I, I've never really realised it said it could be so, so rough. This was my decision. I can't let a little airsick go slow now. Okay, are you doing your right? Well, it looks like it's <laughs> looks like this is gonna be a long trip for Enrique. Yeah, don't worry about it, Enrique. Once you get used to the sailing, you won't get sick as easy. I'm sure you'll be okay. Dang the old man. Hey, look! Hey, it took you guys long enough to get here. Wait a minute, is that? Oh! Hey, it's good to meet you, your voice, right? Gilda told us that you needed a crew, so we're here to report for duty. <laughs> ah! I'm Brabham. If anything's broke, I can fix it. I'm the greatest engineer that ever lived. It's a nice looking ship. If you want, I can get when it's smooth and ever. Crank it up a few notches, give it more power. <laughs> ba ba boom! I'm Isabel. You want something built? I build it. You don't want something built? I build it anyway. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> You want something built, I'll build it. If you don't want something built, I'll build it anyway. <laughs> oh, there's some buildings for you. You're gonna need a base, right? Uh, sure, thank you. And before we get to home, we need some funds to come and expose the neighbor. Ah, brilliant. You can now pass through the stone reefs. Then I'll upgrade your engine so you'll be able to power through the sky in no time. Ah. It cost you 25,000. Ooh! And the video of port with some movie calls first. See, Shing! 70 fucking hell! 75,000? Whoa! All together, I need about 100,000 gold. Well, the thing is, just need modifications, we're gonna need more than a couple of caves to call this a base. Okay, it's right. Uh, Enrico is right. Let's put off the search for the other moon crystals until we can get 100,000 gold paid to some gentleman. How much do I have? I think I've got enough to. Yep, I have 100,000. Yep. Pra! Yippee! I can now fortify the hull and the this for you. You'll be going through stone reefs and sky reefs in no time. Brilliant! 75,000 start building the quarters. Yeah, there you go, 75,000. That's just about all my cash gone. <laughs> no, I mean, this will be the best investment of your life. 
I wish this base wasn't so secret. I want everyone to see how great it's going to be. New Hall of Defenders will be done by tomorrow morning. You'll then you'll be able to go after those crystals. Right. You're able to go just about anywhere. But it Oh, I just remembered. We were talking about making a new flag, right? If everything is finished, we can decide on one. I forgot all about that. Oh, are you nice? You first. What? Be first? Uh, well, I've got a lot of thought in this. Don't laugh, people. This is what I drew. <laughs> Being an pirate and all, I figured we should at least do the skull part of the flag. I love that flag. It looks awesome. It looks badass, man. Screenshot. And since most pirates use soil, I think we should have one of those flags too. Yeah, that's pretty good. Alright, I get you next. I think the skull thing was overdone, so I tried something quick and cunning. That's why I drew a cat. What? <laughs> I just go to show people that we'd sneak up on them and steal their gold before they knew what happened. You know what? I love this one. I love this one as well. <laughs> yeah, that cat looks just like you. Well, I had to get that cat some personality. You think it's a little carried away? <sighs> Way too carried away. <laughs> oh, if you know, it's your turn. <laughs> well, I feel that skulls were a little too scary, so I wanted to make something happier. Design a flag so that people will see us coming. They will both cheer for our arrival for those that are on our side, and enemies are gonna be like, oh shit, they're on our way. And this is what she designs. A dolphin with wings and a happy smile going, ah <laughs> so Oh shit, the happy dolphin's here! <laughs> Fuck me, the happy dolphin's here! <laughs> oh no, we're gonna die, the happy dolphin's here! <laughs> um, uh, uh, oh, oops, wrong button. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to take a screenshot of that. That is just ridiculous and amazing at the same time. An ancient crusader is in the sea, I drew one of them to show you what our ship was named after. Wow! There's no reason to be around Sweden. I don't think there's anything in the Empire that looked like this. I like it. <laughs> oh, that's all of them. Nice, you're the captain. Which one do you like? Uh huh. <sighs> hmm. You know what? I've decided for the lols, I'm gonna go with Fina's flag. Yeah, like Phoenix flag. It's very original. People will remember the name of our ship. Doesn't exactly strike fear into the hearts of anyone, but it's it shows our good intentions. Yeah, good point. Oh, thank you. I'm so glad. When I finished it through, I thought it might be a bit little strange. Well, I'll hang one up in the bridge too. Oh, and it's getting late. Let's get okay, hungry too. <laughs> hey, everyone, dinner's ready. Yay! Great timing. <sighs> well, looks like they're spending the night at the new headquarters, Crescent Isle. Well, the Imperial and ship are almost finished, and pretty soon we'll have an actual base on this island. Yeah, so in the moment we should start searching for the remaining moon crystals. Yes, but I hope this time I won't get airsick. <laughs> You'll have to get over that. Oh, Fina, there's something I want to ask you here. That Admiral, um, what was his name? Ramirez? How do you know him? What? When we met him in the Strad, you seem. No, uh, when we met him in the Strad, you seem to know a lot more about him. <coughs> Hmm. 
If you don't feel like telling me, it's okay. Don't worry about it. <coughs> no, I'm sorry. I should have told you all about him sooner. I will tell you everything I know about Ramirez. You know that I am a Silvite, descendant of the Silver Civilization. Ramirez is a Silvite as well. What? Ramirez was our best warrior. He could channel the power of the Silver Moon through his blade, make it sharp enough to cut through light. Which is what exactly you felt in uh, that battle. We grew up together a long time ago. But, and he, uh, a long time ago, he was one of my best friends. He didn't used to be so, so heartless and cruel. He used to care about, care for me like a little sister. When we heard that the Lurens were trying to be awake in the Gigas, Gigas, Ramirez volunteered to come down here to stop them. He went on a journey in search of the crystals, alone. Shortly after he started his quest, we lost track of him. He never even dreamed that he would join forces with the Balloon Empire. Those were the people that he had sent he was sent there to stop. And yet he is soon. I don't know why he has changed. I heard the Ramirez I knew isn't gone forever. I remember Ramirez. Not only is he one of Valu's greatest swordsmen, but he's also a massive strategist. He used to be Glissian's vice, vice command captain. But I don't think Glissian knows Ramirez's past. Fina. Do or do not, there's no try. Cheer up, Fina. We're here for you now. Two rare pirates, a silvite, two crazy old men, a snot nosed brat, and an air sick prince. But who can't stand a chance against us? There's no other ship that can boast a more motley crew. Apart from perhaps the motley crew. <laughs> Vice. You know what? What Vice is trying to say is that you aren't alone. I'm not sure I appreciate his comment about the air sickness, but we're all together now. Vice. There you go. Enrique. When I came here, I was all alone. Now I have so many wonderful friends. Thank you so much. Thank you all. I, I will do my best. Alright, tomorrow let's continue our search for the rest of the moon crystals. We will start early. Oh, Enrique, are you sure you can get up in t on time without the servant to wake you? Hey, I always get up on my own. I don't need any servant. <laughs> <laughs> We're all having fun. At Enrique's expense. Well, it's time. We know where should we head next. Oh, that's the lovely blue moon. The land is known as Jeffrey Well, whatever that is. They harness the powers of the blue moon and control over wind and water. Their culture is very different from yours. Yafutama, Yafutama. You've heard of it, Enrique? Yes, according to the moon historians, is a country far east of the Sahar. It's scattered across several small islands. I remember the stories of people are protected by scales and they eat by manipulating two sticks. And, yeah, I was just thinking it was going to be very eastern uh, focused. Huh? They eat with sticks? And are protected by scales? <laughs> what? 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 There goes her imagination again. There goes her imagination again. I mean, look at that. So I don't think it's what you're imagining, I okay. I wonder what these strange wind and water people look like, and still can't imagine eating them with two sticks. I was hoping we get to eat all kinds of exotic food on our trip. This has me a little worried. Ah, it's fine. I'll just eat it with my hands. <laughs> 
to Yatufuma. We should sail around the southern tip of Nassar. Some time ago, during the Valuan Nassar War, a cape was discovered just by invading Valuan forces south of Nassar. That cape was named Cape Victory. There is a city there called Esperanza. If anyone knows how to get to Yafuma, it would be the people there. Let's go! Okay, we're heading, so we're heading to South Asar. Alright, ready to battle stations, let's go. Or to your stations, rather. Unfortunately, I want to visit Crescent Isle. And have a look at our base. Anyway, this is going to take a while. I need to start with the foundation to work my way up. So if you're going after the moon crystals, now's a good time. Oh. Alright, so that's fine. Okay. So the Terfarnas is uh, upgraded and we can go through rifts and, and shit. Where am I facing? Oh, that's the wrong way. Oh, well, it's the right way if we were going to do the missions, but first I want to try and find, uh... First I want to try and, uh... Well, I need to get back over to here, because, uh... Here's where I can get one of those, um, things. And now, since I can go through rock reefs and normal reefs, I can just uh, go straight this way. Or rather, this way. Can I go up? Wow, well, look how high I can go! Can I get over? Oh, I can just, just, just barely. Come on. Oh, fuck it. Nearly. Nearly go over. Just go this way instead. Ah. <laughs> yeah, I need five of those special things, and uh, if I can't, if that guy is unreachable, then I'm fucked. Basically. That's an utter victory. That's a victory. Ah, oh, he's leveled up. Okay. Because you maybe not suck anymore. Probably a bit much to ask. No, oh, come on! Oh, there we are. There we go. <laughs> oh yeah, we can pass through the rock areas now, can't we? Oh, maybe this, but we can't go through. But it has to be down this way. All right. Well, I need to go this way anyway. Um, Temple of Prin. Wasn't there a build? Yeah, remember. That's where I'm going past. There's a pirate we keep bloody... I keep trying to face, and he's meant to be around here. Oh! Has he appeared? Is that actually him, or is that another... Or is that the same thing? That's before. Well, 
What? Oh, these monsters must have attacked me before I got an app. Got a chance to attack the pirate. Flying fucker. This is always hard to hit, but they're worth lots of gold. Oh, oh come on, I'm so many levels above this thing, I should be able to kill it. I can't even I can't even hit the fucker. I don't remember missing it this many times when I was here. There we go. An utter victory. No, uh, Fina managed to hear with no muscle. Yeah, I want to get this battle on. I think it's different from before. No, it's the same bloody. No name pirate. Pirate, we don't give a shit about. This good command, he will double all your spirit points for one turn. He will protect your ship from the ca enemy cannon fire for one turn. Oh, okay. That, that's interesting. Thanks, Marco. He's gonna do it so we can double our points. Now, this is kind of funny because look how small that ship is compared to this big bass that we have. Once we open fire on him, he's gonna be fucked. Nice to try out the combat with this ship because we've not really had a real combat with this ship. <laughs> yep, missed. Because we're so much more powerful, and I've just used to put my captain's stripes on it. So we should be pretty fucking powerful. Oh, torpedo that hit. <laughs> wow! That barely scratched the ship. That was nothing. the advanced cannon yeah this ship is fucked I doubt it's gonna survive long enough for another round Well, it 
is the weaker cannon, isn't it? Ouch. Two cannons, fire! Ooh, it was destroyed with one hit. Damn! Come on, all cannons, fire! Here we go, all cannons, fire! <laughs> You're fucked. <coughs> That's what I want to see. No, nothing interesting then. That was the temple where that thing came alive and we fucking killed it. something I discovered, wasn't it? What's that in the air? Ah. Yeah, maybe I'll find that one day. Oh shit! It's a whole bunch of scorpions! Enrique can't even fucking kill these things. Take this, you cur! Take this, you cur! Okay, now he kills it with a crit. If I go straight down there, I'll go for all those bloody tornadoes and shit. But I should be able to go straight that way. Because I can go through the, uh, the wind currents now. Ah, uh, missed. Silver moon? Can we just run? Retreat! Retreat! Mostly because it's just a pain in the ass. It's not going to give me that much experience or uh, gold just sitting there. Come on, in we go. There we go. Yeah, I found nothing on these islands, despite them being kind of weird looking. Oh yeah, I want to return back to the main island and see if we can uh, recruit any people on Pirate Island. Probably not, but worth a shot. Spare me, I have nothing 
Something wrong. The family feed. Oh. All right, let's ask around and see if anybody wants to join. Hey there, Vice. I heard you not only managed to escape through again, but you stole their best ship as well. That's incredible. But we've got a new ship too. Just finished the last provision, the Albatross 2. Yeah, a long time underground port, and it's finally finished. Kids, join me on my adventure! Never mind. They didn't seem to be too interested in coming on my adventure. How about these two? No, there are six different no. I'm not interested in learning fucking stats. Turns out nobody wants to come on the ship with me. Wait a second there. I may be there, but I'm a gentleman. I refuse to look through a lady's dress without permission. <laughs> I'm a bit. Uh, the vanity? I guess. Even she can be feminine sometimes. <laughs> oh, bloody hell. That's a bit depressing. Poor Edgar, didn't know that. Well, I'm glad things are all happy here. But I want some fucking crewmates, damn it. Well, that seemed like it was a bit of a waste, but oh well. Well, I've caught one extra moonfish. And now... Not north. I need to go... West to get to here. That's it. See the fish up there, you must be able to reach them. Maybe that's an upgrade I get later. Yeah, that's from the bullshit. Yeah, that's only three fucking. Huh. Smush them! Sixty-six. Oh my God, Cupid is the devil. 
That was easy. It might be a different later, I guess. It's an aggravating little fucker, though. Crystalline. And there's no more numbers, which suggests I've maxed out that uh, ability now. At least I'm guessing that's what it means. Green Moon! Alright, there should be a. Uh... That's what I'm looking for, I think. Berries and seeds. We really like eating sky sizes, but they're harder to catch than berries and seeds. Can you please. Yes, I've got ten! Chomp, chomp, chomp! Mmm, the fish! Yes, Abrick Chan! That's what I need. That's, those are the best sort of chams to get for, uh, for Cupil. There you go, he's gotten much more powerful now. There's only five available in the game. So what I was saying, I hope I haven't fucked myself over. Oh, where are the others? That's where I bloody keep forgetting. Uh, let me double check. I did have a list here of all the different... Tend to the merchant after helping him in the game earlier. The Cabal Skewer side quest. Never heard of it. Oh, okay, it's something you have to do. That's three Abric charm, uh, charms, but according to this thing, it said that Cupil can get about five of the fuckers. No, three. Okay, three is the maximum you can get. Right, 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 right. Spear is what? Oh no, it turned into lance. That's what it's turned into. Oh, shouldn't it turn into the spike? Because I've got more chans? Oh, no, mind. Wait, wait, it turned into cutlass, so it must have at least 16. Yeah. Okay. I thought I had more than that, but no. So it's turned into lance. I need a lot more uh, of those things. I need more abric thingies. Ah, oh, shit. Well, there's no information on if that chap shows up again. Let me just search quickly online if, uh... Bad. That's rad. Right, that's rad. Does he appear again? Soundtrack.
Oh, fuck this. I'm just going to assume it is, but when the place is repaired. I assume it gets repaired anyway. We are heading to the east! Alright, we gotta see Cupid's new attack, why not? Woohoo! Oh, for God's sake. Little slippy bastards. Alright, see. Go, <laughs> ha ha! Nicely done. Although it looks a bit more like an umbrella than Lance, but there you go. Yeah, yeah of course they run. How about you? Yeah! Just cut across here again. Well, I should be able to cut down there. Or can I go straight south? Looks thicker than normal, but. As you chances are, if I go this way, I'll probably find monsters that are too powerful for me. But let's see. Fish! Not quite what I was intending to get into, but never mind. Oh, not these fuckers again. Retreat! Yep, this looks like a land of ice. Not meant to be where we're going, but uh Ooh, what's down there? Is that not a location? And I'm gonna probably get killed by stupidly going somewhere that I'm not tough enough yet. Penguins Or a kill it. Well we'll fucking kill it. Let's see how we do with uh, this first. Okay, not that bad. Oh. They can't do much. Well, they are doing quite a bit of damage, but not huge amounts. And we're not quite cutting them down either. Yeah. Here we are. Okay, never mind then. Yeah. Never mind, we're gonna keep uh, go across south ways to get to the east. Ah. Well, the chances are those discoveries won't be allowed until uh, until we have to come down here. Ah. Ouch! So let me get that straight. We're Of the eight crystals, we have two, which means we're probably going to be in for a very long haul for this game. <laughs> yeah. 
There we go. Especially with all the discoveries and that. Yeah, if I remember I was told that you can't actually pick up these discoveries until like arbitrary part of the game, which I think is a pain in the ass. But also think it's a pain in the ass that you can't you know fucking uh, find these discoveries. Uh, that you have to find them in a limited amount of time, otherwise Oh, lands of ice, okay. Woo! I found the lands of ice! Could say I've got chills and they're multiplying. It's electrifying. Gotta get up. <laughs> Weevils. Not this spell. Is 100%. Right. So it's green, so I could have done one with green. <coughs> Especially as Aika here has uh, maxed out her purple. Change her to green because she's maxed up purple apparently. Oh damn it! There we go. No one else has those, so we can be happy with that. There we go. Oh come on! Yes, just about. Hey, uh, he counter attack. Oh, poison. Fuck. That's it, Mickey. Oh, I mean, he's weakened as well, so that doesn't help. That doesn't help matters, does it? Oh, what? Over there. Yes. Cupid, you know what? Ready? Yeah, see what I mean? If that's why I'm assuming that means is that. She can't get any more experience than that, which probably means she's maxed in that area. There you go, we healed up the uh, damage there. Nothing here, no. We have to raise, I'm not allowed to bloody see it. Right, here we are. To the east. Apparently, a very different world than uh... Ooh. things all crimson. Lands here. Oh shit. Ah.
Who are they? Blue! Same as the last thing, they're weak to green and purple, so that's fine. Come on! That's it. See, upgrading, uh, getting that, uh, what's it, his name is really effective. Haha! Esperanza. After discovering the world is round. What? Huh. The world is round. Oh, no. <laughs> right, let's look out for a town called Esperanza. Yeah. This doesn't sound too eastern. It sounds a little, um... Spanish. We did it! Ah. Moonberry, yes! Need more moonberries. Woohoo! Found a blimp wreck! For the element of ships, blimps rule the skies as a means of exploration. Here lie the ruins of one man's dreams. He tried time and time again to repair his blimp and cross the dark rift. It was defeated by the fierce winds. Ooh. The dark rift. Edgy. Ah, you asshole fish. Dark Rift. Though from the sounds of it, no one's actually been here. What the fuck? Green. What's strong against green? Red or yellow? Let's go with red, because we're not using much red, are we? And red can give us that, uh, like, uh, oh, oh shit, that powerful version of Incrim. There we go. Good one, Enrique. You're getting there. Ha! All right, that's dead. Fire like a missile. Oh, don't call allies! Thank God for that. Failed. Oh. They're being attacked by these random plants. Oh, one, the other one fucked off. <laughs> one left! Oh, nearly. That's it. One more hit. There we go. <laughs> that was easy. Yeah, apparently if you get all three charms, then... Yeah, you get all three charms and uh, Cupid becomes the most powerful weapon in the game. However, according to the wiki, it seems to only be the most powerful in the game 
if you got the like a uh, DLC for the uh, Dreamcast version. This isn't the Dreamcast version. And it's a dream the Dreamcast version. It was 500 extra like attack, but this version is only 300 extra attack, which still makes it pretty fucking powerful. Maybe not as powerful as say um. Maybe not as, pa not as powerful weapon in the game anymore, but pretty fucking powerful. An utter victory. Ha! Huh. That's a victory. Well, I am going straight across here. See if we find landmass. Because I assume landmass is around there somewhere. No! Fucking fish! I'm guessing it's up this way then. Let's go in the map. There's uh, a bit of land here, so I'm thinking. Oh! I think I saw something then. Before I got attacked by assholes. They're green as well. All right. Attack! Ooh. Oh, fuck off! Ooh. Oh god! If I was saying these things, my allergies really act up. That thing ran away. And I said if I might attack these things, I'd pop. I was some of these things, my energies are probably act up. Ooh. Is it guarding itself? I think it is, because it took a lot less damage than any of the other one has. Magic has failed, because it's just got a question mark. Oh, come on. So close to destroying it. Huh. Attack. There we go. Oh, An utter victory. Utter victory. Where? Yeah, see, there is a city there. I knew it. I have discovered these lands. I shall name this Arantopia. Anyway, uh, for the minute, I will need to uh, be right back. <laughs> You know what? I think I'll put it to a vote on uh, on Twitch if uh, what what people enjoy the most, which are the flags they enjoy the most. Because I'm curious what people think. Right, we have found the land to the east. I think. Oh, that's Espinosa. Espinosa. But only after we discover the world is round, apparently. Hmm. Well, that's inviting. That sky rift looks worse than any of the others. Ah, oh, the other one over there with the void. The black void. If you try to power our way through, I think the Delphinus will get ripped to pieces. But if we don't go through there, we won't be able to see. Reach Yafutama. Isn't there something we can do? <laughs> <laughs> There's Enrique being sick again. Enrique, you feeling any better? No. To be completely honest, I feel awful. 
Why don't you guys take a look at this? Uh, I don't think it would be wise to, for me to move in my condition. I'll stay here and look after Enrique. Alright, there you go. Let's go and check out the city. Someone here has to know how to get to Yash... Uh, yes, uh, yes, uh, de <laughs> degenerate ex Valuan soldier. This city was built by Valua during the time when Valua was trying to extend its hand on of influence into the rumored in countries of the Far East. Everyone used to be full of hope here, but once we realized that it's impossible to go through the Dark Rift, that hope disappeared. And one day Valua decided to leave this city to rot. So yeah, they lost their ships, their crews, and their dreams. <laughs> Doggo! Oh, oh. Aw, poor thing. Another oh, one the scummy city of Valua. That one is uh, quite tame and it seems a bit scared. It seems about depressed as everybody else in this area. So no, we haven't found the east. I thought we had, but nope. Means we're at another uh, Valuan stronghold. Chirping around here. Hmm? Well, there's John Scarver if it's an even Maelstrom. I've heard that once you go inside the vortex, everything gets a little strange. There's no light and compasses don't work. Basically, it's easy to lose track of where you came from. Huh. Well, at least that's what some of the survivors said. I don't know if they're telling the truth or not, though. Hmm? Let's check inside this building. Oh, there we go, we've got a save point. So I'm assuming this is obviously the uh, inn. Yep. Oh, Dusty, not many guests. Well, I can imagine, uh, imagine not. I was able to trace my brother as far as Spurnza. Perhaps everyone was right, and my brother headed into the dark rift. The letter ends here. Yeah, it's been many years since somebody outside us last year. That's 200 diggy gold, and you wanna stay? Nah. I see, you're not in other places in the city, perhaps you'll change your mind later. Now, piss off. People are the same. If you're not constantly brushing up your skills, you'll start to get rusty, rusty, just like this old tower. I oh, see nothing here. Nothing here. Useless rust. Damn you, you rust piece of junk. Well, I'm thinking of going up here and exploring a bit more. 
Might be so interesting up here. I wonder, is there... There might be a moonfish around. They usually hang around near, you know, populated places or places that were populated. And yet, secluded away from them, so I don't know what the hell they're doing. Oh, that's a big cannon. Oh. Alright, you're mine! Yeah, see, it's good idea to come up here. Completely rusted and probably explode if you try to fire it. Oh shit! It's quite how dangerous it looks. It's more dang It seems to be more dangerous to the user than uh, anyone else. That's it. That's it. Here we go. Now we've got two moonfish to bring back now. I wonder if the bloody yeah. Cham is down here somewhere. Oh. Yep, another cham. Must have fed him a lot of chams by now. Barely edible. Charms. Like one little charm. Hmm. Fish there's broken. I hope the authorities don't mind me uh, investigating the uh, sensitive areas. Whoa! 2,248 gold! That was worth it. Free gold, I'm not gonna complain. Oh, I've not checked this out yet, have I? Well, I've all your loaded books, and all about navigation and dark lift. Oh, it's Thingy from Foster's Home Imaginary Friends! Hello there! Hey, it's the newcomers! Let me guess, you came here hoping to get the legendary lands of the East, right? My parents were the same way. When I was just a little girl, my parents brought me here with plans of going through the lands of the east. My ship sank and I've been here ever since. Uh, what a waste. The rest of the world will never be able to see how pretty I've become. <laughs> that is a waste. That is a waste. You could join my ship. Huh? My parents? They went down on the ship. Killed by Maelstrom. Ooh. Hey, don't worry about it. They were foolish for thinking they could get through the Dark Rift anyway. cold way to look at it, but uh, she's got a point. Uh. 
Campfire indoors? This is an interesting way to cook food. All of our problems are foolish people who try and follow their dreams but fail. Just keep your feet on the ground and you'll be alright. Because people thought of going to the far off lands of these and we're stuck here. I need to go anywhere, the fools. I say it is hard to argue against that considering how many people have died just uh, attempting to go through that maelstrom. Date stand, but this has been partially rubbed off. It's empty though. Well, best of two. Oh, boy, is fast. Mm -hmm. Down to the Cafe du Champ. Hello, sir. Are you falling asleep? Pitiful sailor. Not from around here, are you? Actually, we just came to town. We were wondering if someone would help us. So you came to me. Well, that's just good. By the way, the name is Don. Now, ask me your question, but be on my way. Let's go to the east. How do you get through it? Oh, there's a. What the fuck? He's gotten really excited now. So, you're looking for a way to cross the dark rift, eh? Uh oh. That got everyone's attention. <laughs> so this world is still full of fools. <gasps> mm -hmm. What? Are you kids serious? You're trying to cross the dark rift? They don't stand a chance. Someone better tell their parents where they are. Kid, that's no ordinary sky rift. Glug, glug, glug. Hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. During the war, this cape was discovered and this city was built. This place is the edge of the world. If you try and go any further east, you'll be killed. Hundreds of men, good men, have died trying. There's always a few fools that don't heed the warnings. The Dark Rift usually claims them. So the best sayers from all over the world tried to cross the Dark Rift. They came from everywhere. One by one they tried to pass through the Dark Rift. The woman failed. Ships entering the dark rift are either pushed away by the winds, or they get sucked in, never to return. The crew and I lost our ship. We were lucky to survive. After a while, they stopped coming. All we do now is sit here and wait to die. Glug, glug, glug. Some say it's just impossible, kid. <laughs> Something's just impossible, kid. Why don't you just go back to wherever you came from and have your mummy tell you a bedtime story? Ooh. Hey! What's wrong with you people? You throw your lives away. Don't you care about anything? Guys, let's go. We're just wasting our time here. Thanks for telling me about the Dark Rift. Before I go, I just want to say that I've never met a more pitiful bunch of my life. Lose sight of one dream, but place it with another. Think about how much you could have accomplished in the time that you spent here. Just because you couldn't cross the dark rift, are you just going to sit here the rest of your life? Because you tried something once and failed, are you going to throw the rest of your life away? It's a whole world out there to see. Don't you have the desire to sail again? I think that's a yes, he does. Oh, what the hell? Fina, what is it? Fire, so you can come to the park quickly. The Armada is coming. What? What are they doing here? Okay, let's move. Better not hurry to the port. Better hurry to the port and hide. I don't want them knowing we're here.
Oh, uh, that's three moonfish. Yeah, let's see what he has. Aha! He's got a nice sword in there. Nice swing thing to have. The cat's tunic, really? And battle worn armor. Miracle robe. Hmm. Yeah, more magic protection. He sells a shitload of stuff. Uh, detect targets at night. To detect targets at night? I'll buy them just in case. Deluxe kit, balloon torpedo, I already have. Cannon, advanced cannon. Uh, compound deck, which I already have. Hmm. Move a fish that live around the dark rift. Bet there are fish that haven't even changed. No oh, I wonder what they look like. So apparently I'm meant to return here after I've proof after I have proof the world is round. No idea why, but yeah. What did it say? Prove the world is round. Oh after discovering the world is round. The bartender. Yeah, speak to the bartender. What happens if you speak to her now? to discover the world is round, but never mind. Yeah, I'm sure we weren't just seeing things, because they want to try and go through the rift as well. Now, if it was an idiot in charge of it, they'd probably just charge straight at the uh, rift and then get destroyed. But, yeah, as Ramirez is in charge, he's probably going to do the smart thing, which is gather information before he uh, attempts it. Oh, Vice, you're back. I think you need to see this. It depends if they stop this town or not. They look like they're stopping this town. Bloody hell, look at that. Admiral Gregorio was the best defense tactician in the Lunar Armada and has ever seen that they nicknamed him Iron Wall. Interesting. Not located around town. Oh shit. Here they are. Come be off of Admiral Gregorio. Oh, 
I hope my prince finds himself in good health. I heard that you had a tinge of heart, or perhaps brainwashed by the air pirates. And for some of your escorts, my prince back to Valua so that he may recover. Nothing to recover from. This refuses to comply, my ships will regretfully begin firing upon the city tomorrow at noon. Your humble servant, Gregario. <sighs> uncle? Bloody hell. Yeah, uncle? Glory was an animal in the Armada even before my father passed away. He helped raise me when I was growing up. He's always been like an uncle to me. Ah, right, okay. I know he doesn't want to fight, and he really does want me to surrender. But I can't go back. Not after everything they've done. Even if, even if it means I have to fight him. Vicky. Okay. Let's rest up for tomorrow. We are the most honoured. Honourable man that I've ever met, he won't break his word. Uh huh. As then we should rest in the land tonight and keep you off the ship until tomorrow. Like me. That's the thing you need is for your uncle to see you throw, throwing up all over the railing in the heat of battle. <laughs> Great, now you're starting to sound just like an echo. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Come on, let's. Stay at the end of the night. We're gonna need our rest. Yeah, they decided to blockade the place. Not like much trade happens here anyway in the first place, but... Say the Armada has come here. We were given this town a long time ago. Why would they bother coming back? It's a crazy like that. Yeah, okay, well when the bombardment starts, just uh just don't act like we didn't warn you. It's time to go fight him, Admiral Gorario. It's going to be a tough battle. Give it everything you got. Oh yeah! Hey, you're actually gonna fight against the Armada, are you? Yeah, of course we are. Huh? You're planning to fight Admiral Royo by yourselves? Yep, that's the plan. I don't doubt your abilities, but I used to be a valuable soldier. I know what the Armada can do. Going up against one of the animals is crazy. My ship is the best of it. We're faster than the Royo ship, and I think we can match his firepower. But even if you win, you'll never get through the Dark Rift. Like I said yesterday, our ship is the best there is. Our engines are more powerful than you think. And it might just be powerful enough to get through the Dark Rift. Besides, ever since I was a kid, I've always wanted to see what was beyond the edge of the world. That very edge is right in front of me. I have a chance to do what nobody has ever done before. I have a chance to make history today. If I said that I'm not scared, I'd be lying. But I won't let this opportunity pass me by. This is film my childhood dream lies right in front of me. You don't expect me to just give up, do you? <laughs> I suppose then, no matter what I say, you're not gonna listen. Now see, that's the pistachio pyro. <laughs> Dark Rift is a giant vortex. If you can get through one side, you'll reach. The eye in the middle. There's room and the eye is calm. There are other calm pockets along the edges of the dark rift. If you find one of the pockets, you might have half a chance. Uh huh. See, thank you. I'll come back when I'm done, I promise. You're just like me when I was your age. 
Ah, he's just like Vice, was he? Admiral, the Dufanus is approaching. He's moving into attack position. Our orders are to bring him back alive. Or we'll kill him if he refuses. We must do everything in our power to take him alive. All ships, prepare to attack. Dufanus is the most powerful, most powerful ship. Our right, adversaries may be young, but we can't underestimate them. Guys, the Armada is getting ready to attack us. This is it. Everyone, man your power stations. We've got to get past Admiral Guerrero's defenses. We will defeat him. Then we'll get through to the Dark Rift Beast Jeff. Let's go! Let's see. Aye aye! aye, aye. We've got a number of crew with us as well. Hey, pirate scum! Hand the prince over! You'll pay for kidnapping the brain and brainwashing him! Again, another reason I've, it's a good thing I gave the captain stripes to the ship. Fragmentation missed. That's it. See how he likes the Moonstone Cannon. Not much, I assume. Yeah, he might, if he's still alive after the Moonstone Cannon. I hope he's not, but... Hell, I'm boosting my attack and defense. So if I do fire on him with the Mount Moonstone cannon, he's uh Ooh, he's gonna be one tough bastard. Alright, here we go, Moonstone Cannon! Can boost him. Yeah, that didn't surprise me. Yeah, go turn. No, not that way. You idiots, what are you doing? You're supposed to fire out all your cannons right there! Yeah, get them! Hey, they're not that bad! Huh? Shit, run! <laughs> they still need to get past the next line of ships. They still have a long way to go. Ow! Ouch! <laughs> yeah, I, I thought that was a bit too easy. 
Because it wasn't the main admiral, the admiral's main ship, was it? That's his main ship. Oh no, it is. Never defeat the second fleet of the Armada. Fleet of the Armada. Boost of our speed as well. Might as well. At the moment, it's all green, which means I shouldn't be getting any uh, or much damage. Which probably means they're also going to be building up attack, a uh, massive attack. Also, uh, boosting his focus, aren't we? There we go. May not survive. This may actually survive the Luso cannon. I know. I know the uh, the general will definitely survive the Luso cannon shot, but this one might. Shredder bomb. You're a tough motherfucker, aren't you? Ah, your best charge missed, fucker. Damage that, isn't it? Close in. Yes. That's twenty. Okay. Right, 
that's gonna be interesting then. Close in behind him. That's it. Moonstone cannon fire. Eat this. See, nearly destroyed. Nearly. I knew it wasn't going to go down that easy. Now, let's fire on him. Ha <laughs> ha! Gotcha! Another one's done, another one's done. Another one, bastards! Woohoo! They're going to get you too. Another one, bastards! We're doing great! Throw your ship to the head! It will be winged shortly! I can't let you take me back! Yes! Alright, full speed ahead! It's now or never! Hmm. Jesus! Yeah, his is much more dangerous. And stop fucking up! System, stop fucking up. Prince Enrique, please forgive me for taking up arms against you, but you leave me no choice. I'll not allow you to escape. You're enough to get past the arm. You're okay. Um, hmm. no, go. No cannon yet. Save up actually. Or maybe just let the one off. Maybe okay, so the ship's quick. Oh, I see. Having having these people actually helps with the. Uh... Ah. I should go around and search for the other members of the crew, to be honest. Right, here we go. Let's build up that focus. And then the more members of the ship we have, the more SP we can have as well. Bits of action. Heal up. Oh shit. Didn't realize I lost that many hit points. We have a single shot at this guy as well. Shit, face up maneuvers again. Haha, <laughs> hit ya! You bitch! Hmm. As said before, Warrior has been nicknamed Iron Wall by his peers. One of his best defense addition. I have heard that he sets up a tight defense and waits for his enemy to make even the smallest mistake as any attacks.
Så. Stor spur. Take in defense, that's what we need. Dodge it. It's gonna have even more cannons. Ouch. Oh yeah, you think you're tough, motherfucker? Eat this! Ha <laughs> ha! 9,000 damage, eat that! There's a fragment gun lost, because he turned sides. Action, that's it. To dodge his main attack, he's coming up with that. Ooh, maybe he can hit us though. Shit. Hmm. Yeah, no perfect time to strike either this time. the attack. Woo! Might be a bit of a waste using that. Ouch. I get this is the green damage he's doing. Which is that not much. which won't crash until uh, the damage is uh, until they're ready to eat our damage fire now they're gonna attack with uh, full force Action. We're heading straight at them. Hold! Oh shit! That's why they're heading straight for us. Whoo -hoo, look at that! We dodged right past them. Jesus! That was some good bloody timing there. Yeah, we dodged his ram attack. Now he's gonna pay. We just wide open. Let's have, let him have it. Yep, yeah, I'm gonna let him have it. Eat this. Fucking hell, not many much spirit left, is there? Yeah, I can't even. Yeah, I can't even do extra stuff. And the missile hit. <laughs> now, how are you gonna enjoy this moonstone cannon up your ass? Yeah, 
Here we go. Time to attack him, really, because it's open. Oh, look at that! Nearly. Oh, oh, nearly. See, I told you it wouldn't came in one air. Yeah, I don't have any more attacks in me, do I? So I can, like, get one little sneaky attack that I take down. Because I'm sick, but it's not getting enough SP in the port. It'd be better if I actually had more crew members, perhaps. What does that give those passive bonuses? It's weak. Oh, you can man the cannons. Focus and focus. Sub cannons, but sub cannons are pretty very powerful. Last charge. No idea what that hit. Fire! Oh, nearly. The nearest sub cannons we're talking here, not main cannons. That's why I, my battles took so long, because I just, I only equipped sub cannons. Oh shit. Missed because we're not facing each other. Ooh, it's attacking. It. It's torpedoes, that is. Come on, fire! Yeah! Fuck you! I'm not going back home. Captain Stripe, heavy armored deck, and a ooh, 12 cannon. It's another sub cannon, but it's a more powerful sub cannon. It's a good thing I have what's the name on board then to get me the extra stuff. thought that if we were ever in battle together, that we'd be on the same side. It's Ricky. Is there anything I can do to make you reconsider? No, I've made up my mind. I'm not going back to Valua. I know that you've noticed a change in the Empire as well. They're headed down a dark path. Trying to rule the world with an iron fist will be Valua's downfall. This world, the sky, is not Valua's to rule. Belongs to the people. And to the fight the wrongs that Valua has committed, I have decided to travel with Vice and his companions. Tell that to my mother, and also that I pray every day for her good health. Oh, that's gonna piss her off. This is goodbye. I must go. Be well. Farewell, young prince. I'm going to think about putting some more RPGs on my list, but of course I'm going to space them out because they are, like this one, going to take quite some time to finish, you know? That's not to say this is shit, no, it's not shit at all. Woohoo! 
Those kids are great. They just took out the Armada with one ship. <laughs> Let's make. They made me feel like singing again. Nice. Don't put on. You put on quite a show. Make it back to the Dark Rift. I hope you come back here and take me with you. Can't believe I'm saying this. You hear me, kid? You better make it back. Oh, I'll make it back, alright. Oh, we don't go through the lift just yet. Alright. Yeah, the time on my minutes might finish early and then uh, so I can